<laughs> Let's have a look around. Seems like you were hiding a whole lot of darkness inside, little lady. Too bad Cecil had to go. That wasn't what I envisioned. But this is consolation enough. Now, shall we begin? Gotta chip away at that soul before I can claim you fully. One way or another, I'm going to live without ever knowing death. You will be my greatest vessel yet. Would I only let you have your way? But you will have to crush every trace of me first. Many lives have you hurt, drowned in miles of sorrow. Now I've come to deliver your just rewards. Hold it. How are you still conscious? And I am the god here. Only I may deliver judgment. By my calculations, you killed me. That's a sin, I'm afraid. So I shall extract fair remuneration. I am well aware. But when will you repay your own debts? No need to concern yourself with my affairs, miscreant. Why must I make that clear? You will elude retribution no longer! <laughs> I see your feeble mind has an overactive imagination. Retribution applies to those who carry blame. And I cannot bear fault, I'm afraid. Everything I've done, I've been justified. Zessel's creation, the seal on those fools seeking eternal life, it was all necessary to ensure I could go on living. And you're one to preach. Look at what you did to keep breath in your lungs. What you say is true. I stole the life from my beloved sister. There. A brazen transgression. So avenge her and die yourself. I will not. I will bear the burden of what I've done. And see the wrongs of this world righted. But you can bear no burden. You refuse to claim your own sin, even though you exist only to raise hail and sneer at your victims. You've not so much as acknowledged all you've stolen, much less remembered your crimes! And what of it? I am a god, rightful in my reign. With that damnable Floess out of the way, my rule is unstoppable. I am a Schillendrig. Who can stand before me? You are nothing. A mere puppet waiting for its master. Your defeat is assured. And with your death, my victory is redeemed. After I take your body, all oh, you Petty humans will bow before me! Yes, that may be so. Assuming they are human lives! <laughs> what makes you think you can withstand me? I have already told you. I am a monster! In the eyes of a god, you're still mortal. We shall find out. For all the times you have accused me of ignorance, of ill understanding, you alone have failed to grasp the most important thing. Actually, I believe you have forgotten it. What sophistry are you spouting now? Have you not felt it? 
the countless repetitions of this world. And within those repetitions, the numerous times we have already lived this scenario. What if I infected you? Now, usually when I infiltrate powerful vessels, every fiber of their being fights me off. But you run on magic, same as me. There's a chance we might be compatible. No! Leave me alone! <laughs> my oh my! Feels like we're gonna explode! Gosh darn it! Guess I miscalculated! <laughs> I am half wretch, with pure magic at my core. I am not what you have come to expect. And that's why stopping you has always been within my capability! <laughs> what absurdity! I pity you, I shillandrig. <laughs> Had you not created Zesselvenchi, I never would have become this horrific creature. Nor would I have the strength to banish you. Did you truly not realize that I too am your creation? I have wandered so long to finally fell you. You manifested your downfall. And she stands before you now! Uh, impossible. There are no impossibilities. You may think yourself divine, but you are nothing in the face of my providence. Uh. I've heard your protests. Why me? How could this happen? It's because you made a monster in your image, and she surpassed you! Nonsense! Your blows no longer affect me. I refuse to believe it. It's futile, Ashillandrig. Don't you dare! I am supreme! Born for victories most infinite! You droves exist only for the sake of your own meaningless despair! Allow me to teach you one last thing. Despair is not meaningless. Yes, senseless violence threatens our safety. And this world is not a forgiven place. And yet, through overcoming our burdens, we are made stronger, in both body and spirit. Where there is despair, there is also hope. That is the true nature of this world. If only there were still hope for you. But your fate has run its course. Now, leave me! <laughs> <laughs> no, I <coughs> reject this. This isn't happening. I don't want to die. You made your coffin. Now die in it. No. Istar, my promise to you is now fulfilled. <clears throat> Sorry to make you wait. <clears throat> well, slap me upside the head. Ha! <laughs> Looks like you were wise not to take my bet after all, Vince. 
I was able to bring our Schillendrake to his fitting conclusion. So it would appear. But how can we be sure? I am Ilgano. He did not steal control from me. Ah, oh, now that's some good news. You are the sun to my morning dewdrop. At the very least, that's one problem off our backs. <laughs> but we've got our hands full somewhere else, don't we? Yeah. Alizard isn't back yet. Reinforcing him strikes me as the correct maneuver. We'll bring up your caboose, right, Selena? I guess we could lend a hand if y'all really need us. Your sentiment's appreciated, but I'm not sure it's necessary. Drock? Come on, it's him, Aluzard. If our great general can't get it done, who can? Odds are we can sit our butts down and wait for him to finish. That's what he'd expect out of us anyway. Besides, not all the chaos from this damn war has died down yet. We've got our own fires to put out. You're right. Let's get to it then. Alizard, who has drifted through eons to stymie stagnation's tide. That he shall find victory in this land, I do not doubt. I am the font of harmony, instrument of peace. Wouldst thou seek to sully harmony, malefactor? Fade and ephemerate! So, you exalt those who do not err. You hold quite the hollow understanding of your victims. It is when the soul comes to know sin, that it learns to live. And, as you will soon find out, the living can birth their own miracles. Nexus, Keeper of Arrogance. It is time we settle things, once and for all! <laughs> 